It is a big deal and would make this country a better place. John Oliver is calling out two Democratic senators for holding up President Joe Biden's $3.5 trillion government overhaul plan. According to the White House website, the Build Back Better Act plans to create jobs, cut taxes, and lower costs for working families, all paid for by making the tax code fairer and making the wealthiest and largest corporations pay their fair share. During Sunday's episode of Last Week Tonight on HBO, Oliver noted that to pass the bill and avoid a filibuster, every single Democratic senator must be on board. But two of them, Kirsten Sinema, of Arizona and Joe Manchin of West Virginia are holding it up. Moderates like Kirsten Cinema and Joe Manchin argue it costs too much. Yet Cinema and Manchin need the support from their more progressive counterparts to pass a related $1 trillion public works bill that they want to pass. Oliver went on to talk about how a group of people kayaked to talk to Manchin about it while he was aboard his yacht. I am not sure which stage of capitalism we've reached if we're now kayaking out to a politician's yacht to beg him to help the poor, but it's got to be one of the last ones. Oliver then called out Cinema for getting smart with a reporter who asked what she would, quote, say to progressives who are frustrated they don't know where you are. She responded with simply, quote, I'm in the Senate. He wrapped up by again emphasizing how the bill could, quote, benefit people's lives. If you are blocking it, you owe people more than vague platitudes shouted from the back of a boat and a cutesy I'm in the Senate comment. For more on this story, go to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.